Welcome back to my channel. Hi everybody. What's up, kitten fam? I hope you are doing well. And people, I'm sorry, I got distracted by my kitten, but things are just A-OK -okay in your world. Um, I have a couple of updates. I know I haven't been filming much, but it's been my daughter's birthday week and she had a friend stay over the night like for two nights it was like our first sleepover so it's kind of a big deal and um overall i'm just kind of um living life i guess as well as i can and enjoying I'm trying to get like a good shot for a picture thumbnail <laughs> thumbnail you'll get to be a part of all that anyway so this is um an updated like planner situation and a quick what's in my bag um i don't have too much in there this is my new purse um i got it on sale at coach and it's just beautiful there i saw it on a girl had it on youtube and i fell in love with it instantly and it is a color block and it's all neutral tones. There are a couple of other colors. And there's like a pink color block. But I'm not into the whole pink. I, I like my neutrals. And um, I fell in love with the shape, the size. As y'all know, I've tried to go a little smaller with my bags a lot more recently. And as long as it fits like my planner, <laughs> it's the main thing then we're good and this is a more slouchy bag the most recent bag I got which is beautiful it's the olive green um, fossil bag it's very structured and sometimes I don't want a structured bag I like a more laxed leather um, but this leather is just pebbly and beautiful I adore it. it's soft squishy um, and just easy and accessible for me i really like it i'm about to share it so what you have here is like this nice rust colored um shoulder strap and it does come with a long ivory um crossbody strap but it's not a super long crossbody um it's the same color as this but i left it in the drawer i'm not going to go get it um i'm just going to use it with this um and then you have this beautiful brown pebbled color here and a beautiful taupe khaki there along with the ivory and it goes turns the brown goes to the back to where your cell phone pouch goes with a magnetic button and that's just beautiful you have an antique gold hardware, which in my case, I adore. That's one of my favorite hardwares is the antique gold. I'm really into vintage <laughs> items anyway. It's just my vibe. Um, you have the Coach C on the front. Sorry, there's something dirty on it. Um, and this is also an awesome magnetic flap so it closes automatically you don't have to worry about anything i really like that um as a coach bag it does come with the tag sorry i'm holding this with my hand not so good um which is in that rust um or burnt sienna color there's the coach and of course y'all know i always have a bunny and it just happens to go really well and yeah now there is a wallet that I wanted to get, but considering I spent a lot of money this week on my daughter, I'm just not, and it's not, it's on sale too, and it's $99, and it goes perfectly with this purse, but I decided not to do it because I just, it's not the time. It's not the time for that. I just, I don't need to spend the money on a matching wallet, although I madly want it, but it's okay. Um, I will survive. So what I'm going to do is flip get you guys overhead so you can see in my bag and go from there all right hi guys okay so i have you overhead let me bring you in just a little if i can do it without taking you guys too far in i'm like the worst at that okay 
so as you can see it is a very pebbly leather so beautiful and it's super soft and squishy which really drew me to the bag and just the shape in general is just glorious and it is fairly roomy so one of the biggest selling points for me was the suede interior this beautiful wine suede interior goes so well with all the neutrals it's just such a beautiful combination i can't even um it's suede on the flap and then it's the cloth inside but even the cloth itself has details of the coach um there's no way i mean it'd be hard to replicate this bag i feel like i don't know there's some people that really can <laughs> so let's get into it as most of you know i film on my phone because i am not a professional um so my phone goes in the back and i have like a leopard um colors that match this so it matches my purse i am one of those types my key ring i got this off amazon not too long ago and I just, it makes it easier to be able to just stick it over my wrist when I need to do go places. And it really has been very useful. So um, I'm glad I did. And it has all my keys on it. And it comes with the white disc and this guy. And I just have like what I always have. My car key, my pool key, and my home key, and my parents key. That's all I carry. I mean, yes, but I carry this <laughs> on my wrist a lot, um, and I really do like it because it's hard to lose, which I like even more, so it's leopard print, and it comes in a lot of other colors and styles as well. Now, looking in, you can see it's just one big, well, it's not huge, but one pocket and or one open space with a zipper pocket it doesn't have any extra pockets so usually I like extra pockets so I can put my things like this in um, but this bag just uh, I wasn't even planning on getting another bag because I just recently got my olive green one and I of course was in love with it but I really wanted a neutral I just fell in love with this and this leather is everything so you can see in there everything kind of matches you may see something new um, but in this pocket, you're going to see a lot of the same items. I'm one of those people that if it works, like I use it. I've got a lamb cum hand cream. I'm just badly in love with the scent. My lavender hand sanitizer and my inhaler. Unfortunately, I have to keep, keep it on me at all times now, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, and then you'll see this beautiful coach, um, tag here. It says this is a coach bag. The, the story patch is our badge of authenticity few people may see it but it will always be a reminder of our commitment to quality and craftsmanship and it really is beautiful just this patch itself is sewn in so beautifully and it has the number down there so you do know this is a great quality bag i do have two other coach purses one of which i'm willing to sell and one of which i adore and will not sell um now you'll see just like some stuff right it's all nice and neat so this is what i'm using for my wallet right now it was <laughs> it's kind of dirty but i don't even care but what's great about it is if i don't want to take everything in i can just hook this to my keys and then i can just go in with this i've gotten to where i like these simple types of wallets I just stick I'm a cash person so I just stick my cash in and I have my um, card holder which is the kitty cat one I got a while back it's leather um what's it by by Carl Hangerfield anyway really cute um it goes in here um I do have a coach little wallet that has candy on it that I was using, but I liked the color combination of this one. This is a kind of leather. It is leather, but it has a cover over it. Um, plastic kind of cover over it, but it is leather. What kind of leather is it? There is a type of, I forgot what it's called. It's not pleather. It's actual leather, but um, yeah, it's that cream color that you'll find on the side of my bag. It's not incredibly white. It's more of a 
cream so this is my wallet for now like i said i really want the wallet that looks really nice with this but it's fine i don't need to spend all that money and then i have a hide and drink pouch um that had my leather book bear bookmarks in it but i'm using it as it carries like my perfume rollerball hold on i'm untying it real quick <laughs> It carries my perfume roller ball in here um, my extra like if I have jewelry or something which I don't wear a lot of in there some day quill and my headache stuff which is just don't oil um, I get really bad headaches just from stress uh -huh. alone so there's that and I'm having one of those days by the way that is just I'm, I'm edgy and I'm just like, ugh, I have these days. But anyway, this is like a nice handmade canvas bag. And even in the inside, it has a um, hand stamped, like, hide and drink, like, I guess, map or whatever of where they're located and stuff. And then the hand stitched leather here I really like this pouch so I'm using it in my person it looks nice as well I am one of those people that like to kind of match my stuff in my bag or at least make it look nice it can be from different brands and stuff that doesn't bother me but um so y'all seen this a lot it's my Michael Kors I guess pochette type this is a wallet it's really large I've used it as a wallet or as a clutch when I use really large bags it turns into my like carry-in but um my daughter made this she wrote me a note and of course touch rose my fave so i just hooked those on there and in here i'm using this as my pencil pouch <laughs> i'm a planner girl god what's well, a mixture of my like my stationary stuff and my compact powder like that i carry um by the way, I just got all new makeup. I'll have to share that with you. It's not a lot. I wanted to get makeup that was good quality and use and neutral because I really love doing very colorful looks, but I think I'm just growing out of doing that a lot now. Um, I'm just getting older, I guess. But um, I've got my Burt's Bees lip balm. This stuff's to repair my really dry lips because I swim all the time. I need stuff like this. Mm -hmm. And I like that it's brown. <laughs> it's a neutral color. I like that. Um, I have my USB in here. Like this is just my stationary catch all, I guess. Um, so if I do need to carry um, some touch up makeup, it will go in here. I know that's kind of like weird to mix your stationery with that, but it would be my, it's my, one of my most used pouches. Like I pull this out a lot, um, when I'm out and about. So, um, even at work, I'm considering work too. Cause I start back at school, working at the school in a couple weeks. I'm at the pool still for two more weeks, but I'm headed back to the school, which Anyway, moving on. Um, positivity. <laughs> so I um, need to consider that when I look into buying new clothes and things, I'm actually purchasing dresses versus like pants. I'm trying, I really want to be ladylike. I don't know. It's just, it's my New Year's resolution, I guess, my goals. So this is new to me. Um, this is one of the Muppet leathers, uh, Fonzie, Fozzie or whatever. Um, it's the, it's the color that I wanted the most, um, besides the Cookie Monster, which I have in a personal rings, but, um, I'm not in rings anymore, and I really am loving this size, and believe it or not, my Hobonichi's not in here, I have a cut down Stology in here, and I've been using it, I do use my Hobonichi week still because it's nice to have all the monthlies, um, in play and the weeklies it's really nice and I have like my long-term um, long-term lists and stuff in here but it stays at home now I don't take it with me um, so we're gonna talk about this um, I guess it, I'm gonna talk about it in another video so this is just a first video I was gonna talk about it in this video but no need so I changed out to the rose gold Ollie clip I have some Ollie clips on the way but you know, I purchased ones that you didn't have to wait on, but yet they're still making me wait a month or two for them. I'm a little frustrated with that, but it's fine. 
Um, so yeah, this leather it does feel a little drier than my other leathers, but I'm just going to find some, con she took really good care of this, you can tell, and it really is a beautiful reddish tone brown. It goes really well with this bag, and I love the texture of the print. Um, it's, I'm very pleased with receiving this. Um, it was one of those... It's one of the things that I splurged on. I did splurge on quite a few items for myself this summer, but hey, I work hard and I'm, <laughs> it's okay. As long as you pay all your bills and you're not in debt, you should be fine. So speaking of bills, I have a bill back here. Um, trying to make it look cute and neutral because I was in the whole black and white thing, gray tones for a while, but um, I may change out like I made like a little place that can change out dashboard So I did put more of a neutral one here, but I really want it to be inspirational as well I've got my new page flags my new color dots that I'm gonna use that I'm using this week um, and I've got some of Coordinating bows just for fun, but that's probably gonna come out. Honestly, it doesn't have any function um, I do have oh, <laughs> This is my swim stuff I do have a calendar in here so I can refer to it um, it's actually the 16th I need to dot those out and the dots coordinate with the colors that I'm using this week but anyway I'll go through that but this is like my color coordination so if you want to see what's in there just check out the next video I'm posting I do use a fountain pen and it has green ink in it so this I could turn this into a wallet as well but I ch chose not to because I don't want to bulk it up too much also one of the reasons why I took the Hobonichi out is because it was just, just too bulky and I was using a TN which I like but I really really wanted my Jillio I'm just one of those people that is Jillio obsessed and once you go Jillio it's hard to go back I'm not gonna lie like I'm not gonna be a <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you it's hard to go back from quality leather and since I am a leather connoisseur like you know obviously I'm a leather bag lover leather notebook cover lover <laughs> leather shoe like I love all the pretty things in leather um and quality materials now i'm not really into like the high high-end stuff like louis vuitton and stuff I'm not really into that but um i do like a decent quality i like coach brand i like fossil um there's some items i like from some of the higher ends but over time i've realized i truly don't like them as much as i do like finding a pure leather item so um you can find some really inexpensive bags on Amazon that are real leather. Um, I've shown a couple on my on my channel if you're interested. Um, I will be selling some of my bags because I have a, like a bag closet, and I like to keep them down. Like I don't want to get so many like I used to have, and I'd like to keep um, my quality is going up the older I get. So um, it's about I have all my bags in my closet or are pure leather and just beautiful but it's time to let go of some because my taste and lifestyle is changing so anyway I hope you enjoyed this bag you can find this bag at a discounted price um, on the coach outlet store and it's still like a couple hundred dollars but it's not as expensive as some others and I think it went down even more since I bought it so it may be under two so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and until next time. Bye